Hi, my name is Emma Walton, and here at Santa Rosa Water, our team manages and maintains a complex infrastructure that carries out a variety of activities with which we strive to accomplish our critical mission to protect the precious and fragile water resources in our beautiful county that protects you and all living things that surround us. We all use water daily, and every year, Santa Rosa Water delivers over 6 billion gallons to homes and businesses in our city, with over 90% of this water coming from the Russian River, supplemented by local groundwater wells. This high-quality water from both of these sources is tested over 200 times before ever reaching a faucet. When that water goes down the drain, it then becomes wastewater. Did you just say the water is wasted? No, because water is too valuable to use just once. After water has been used, it enters the city's sewer system, operated by our crew in blue. Santa Rosa's operators maintain over 600 miles of sewer pipe and pumps that deliver sewage to the regional Laguna treatment plant to be treated, cleaned, and reused as recycled water and biosolids. So how do we do what we do? Let's have our environmental specialist, Denise, guide us through the process of how we clean that wastewater. All sewage coming to the treatment plant goes through four steps of treatment. Primary treatment, a biological treatment, filtration, and disinfection. This clean recycled water is used for parks, grapes, crops, and more. The plant produces a remarkable 7 billion gallons of recycled water per year. And most years, nearly all that water is beneficially reused, offsetting the demand for valuable drinking water. The majority of our recycled water is pumped 41 miles to a geothermal energy production facility called the Geysers, high in the Mayakamas Mountains. There, it's pumped underground to recharge steam fields, which are used to generate electricity for nearly 100,000 homes in the North Bay. By recharging and replenishing the underground steam fields, our recycled water helps to support the generation of clean, renewable electricity. Approximately one-third of our recycled water is used for agricultural or urban irrigation. In years that the plant produces more water than can be reused, the extra recycled water is released to the Laguna de Santa Rosa and returned to the Russian River. The solid component of sewage is processed and turned into nutrient-rich biosolids. Each year, over 30,000 tons are used as fertilizer and soil amendment for the city of Santa Rosa's farms and other agricultural lands. So, there must be some byproducts? Yes. One of the valuable byproducts is methane gas. At the plant, we capture that gas, blend in natural gas, and use it to generate about 30% of the entire facility's energy needs, supplementing energy produced by our solar panels. Protecting the environment is a critical part of our work. In our country, we are lucky to have access to clean drinking water. But the availability is fragile. The supply is limited. Water is a treasure we must not take for granted. Every gallon of water that we at Santa Rosa Water recycle can save a gallon of that precious substance. When we reuse water, it allows us to leave more in local rivers, lakes, and groundwater basins, and helps to preserve sensitive habitat for plants and wildlife. We own 1,500 acres of land purposed for agricultural reuse of recycled water and biosolids, where we help to restore and enhance native biodiversity and ecosystems. Our reach is wide. 
recycled water ponds that provide wetland habitat for birds, aquatic mammals, and many other species. Protected reserves, faunal pools, and creeks located on city farms. Stormwater management is a critical part of our work in preventing creek and waterway pollution. Our people keep a close eye on water quality of 100 miles of creeks by meticulously checking for sources of pollutants, elevated temperatures, sediment, and bacteria 